Hello guys, welcome to my channel. I hope you're excited because you guys have been asking for an organization clean out video for a long time and today that's what we're gonna do. As you guys know, I'm Virgo and I love to clean and organize. So we're gonna go in my bathroom today. All the drawers are just like nasty over filled over stuffed I can barely close some of them and we're gonna clean out every single bathroom drawer the whole bathroom it's gonna take us all day long to do it but you're gonna do it with me and maybe this will inspire you to organize or maybe you're just here to enjoy and just relax and turn on a good old YouTube video okay we love that for you so subscribe to my channel before you leave and come with me to clean out this bathroom that's a mess organizing is like therapy to me though so I love it I hate it but I really love it does that make any sense Probably not. This is gonna be a long video, so I'm gonna need you to get a snack, and we're gonna go ahead and jump right in, and let's go clean this bathroom. Welcome to the bathroom we're cleaning out. This is what my bathroom be looking like, okay, on a regular basis, so uh, yeah, it's lived in, it's used. So we're gonna be cleaning this out. Also my drawers, all these, maybe they are overstuffed, they are overfull, they are crammed. Y'all love a good clean out video. I have my basket ready for get rid ofs. This is new stuff I wanna put away. I have clothes and shoes and stuff I need to put away as well. I just need to clean everything. I need to clean this off. Hey, we're a mess. We have a lot to do today. So let's go ahead and jump right in. We're jumping right in. I meant to throw this in the wash with the rest of my yoga stuff. And I did it and the wash is going. But I'm also going to watch my scrub mix. It's dirty. So these dirty hamper. And then I'm just going to take this jacket and hang it up. Okay, I just need to get the shoes out of here. The hokas. I washed these and they came out completely white and clean and I was so happy and then I went and did a hike again. I need to wear my Oswegos for the hike because they're a nice color brown. I'm talking about these. These are the perfect comfy hiking shoes. These are amazing. So comfortable. So I'm going to start wearing these hiking. We got to get the house slippers. We got to get the Crocs out of here. I love leaving my clothes and shoes in here. And the closet is a problem for another day. Okay, these shoes I'm actually wearing right now, so we're gonna leave these in here and just slip them off. We're officially gonna get started on this. Cleaned. I'm gonna clean these counters after you can see there's like a lot of markings that just need to be cleaned up So I'm gonna do a wipe down at the end and clean up the sinks and all but let me show you the drawers now So you can see what we're gonna be cleaning out this drawer just needs to be straightened up It's where my hair tools go. This drawer is my hair products. That I use on the regular. It's clearly overly stuffed This drawer is not a real drawer because it's the sink but this drawer, however, it just needs to be cleaned up a little bit. It's not bad. It's my hair tools, brushes, and stuff. This drawer is a little overstuffed with my supplies, okay? Uh, gotta clean that up. Now, this is my main main. This is my drawer that has, like, everything in it. And, baby, it is a disaster. Way too much overpack. Stresses me out. I don't even like getting in here, so we're gonna fix that. I need to clean that up. This is backup skincare. Also overcrowded, overstuffed. This is face mask. I have too many. This is backup <laughs> products. I need a lot of this in PR. Y'all know that, right? Y'all know I didn't just go buy all this stuff and I'm just like sitting on it. No. I, uh, it's stuff I want to use like on PR and I probably bought like 5% of it to be honest with you. Okay, and then these are Tyler's drawers which will also be straightening up for him. He loves when I straighten up his drawers. Some people don't like that. They're like, that's my personal stuff. But he is like, go for it. And then this drawer's not so bad, but yeah, that's our bathroom drawers. We're going to clean it out. We're going to dig through each drawer and just make it all gorgeous. Yes. I think I want to empty out this drawer and just kind of rejuge everything. Also, I didn't even know I had this curling on. I think I need to get rid of it. <laughs> we have a speaker that I forgot I had in the drawer. This is the main thing I go to the shore for, is my Dyson. 
me trying heatless curlers and it not working for the millionth time. I'm gonna, oh, I was missing this sock actually. I'm gonna get rid of some of these. I have too many. I like to keep a mini mic in here for when I film content because it's so echoey, but I don't need both of them in here. This Dyson cord is honestly so gnarly. I'm just gonna have to put it like in there. I don't know. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, I actually brought this curling iron from downstairs. It's by Main Addicts. So I wanna keep this in here because I really want a curler in these drawers. Well, this close. Oh, we're good. And then I wanted a hair waver up here because I like to use my hair waver. So I have two of these. So I'm like, let me put one up here. Not gonna fit. Okay, cool. Maybe we'll do the hair dryer. I'm gonna keep my hair mat up here. Put it right there. Dyson extension that I like right here. Actually, I'm gonna do it right there. I do wanna keep my speaker in here. So I'm just gonna place it over here. You know what? It may not look beautiful, but just know it's organized. All right, I feel like this drawer will be way more fun. Just all of my hair care products. A lot of the stuff is stuff I use whenever I'm done blow drying my hair or out of the shower, because I always do that in here. So I think we're gonna take everything out and reorganize. All the drawers lined with this mat. Luckily, nothing spilled in here, but I have it lined just in case to protect the drawer. And I have them all lined. So that was your advice. You guys were like, girl, you better put a lining in those new drawers. So I did, or my assistant actually did all this. She cut all these out. So it's been amazing. <gasps> Look at that. Something leaked. And my lining, my lining saved it. I love that. Okay, so I want to organize. I don't know. I gotta get rid of some stuff. Let's be real. Do I want to? No. Do I need to? Yes. I'm actually gonna go ahead and put these in my shower because I want to use them up. I like this container to put all my hair oils and like smaller items in. This is a really good hair oil. I met met the founder of this on a kiss trip, and I've been enjoying her product. These are also great. Love these as well. Just got this one in from Jennifer Aniston's brand. I can't wait to try. We love some Gisu. I'll probably end up giving Erin one of these, but I love them. I wanted to try this, so I'm gonna keep this little sample. I, this is one of my favorite hair products. It's the Glossening Detangler from Lil Abby. This one is almost empty. I need to use it up, but I have a backup here they sent me, so I'm just gonna stack them. So I use this one first. They also sent me the leave-in conditioner, which I can't wait to use. I've been using my Way one for a long time as well. Same thing here. This bottle's like almost empty, so I, this is the backup, so I'm gonna set the full one on the bottom. Two of everything. Very blessed, um, but I'm gonna use all these, so <laughs> I wanna keep it so I don't have to, you know, purchase it. These are both root lift sprays, and they're really good if you use the Dyson Air Wrap to give you that texture so your hair holds. This is a really good hair primer to protect your hair. I'm gonna get rid of some of my other ones. Love this hairspray for beachy waves or just in general. Also, I like to use this after I wave my hair and the next morning it's kind of frizzy. This helps like melt down the frizz. Amazon spray bottle, you guys know, have to have that. A new sleek spray I'm gonna start playing with from Glaze. A 
another pep prep spray. I don't want to get rid of this one because I want to try it out. And then I have these two styling creams I want to keep. I am getting rid of some stuff I'll show you towards the end. Okay, our drawer is like full and I have more stuff I want to keep. I want to keep this texturizing foam because I just bought it and I want to use it. But well, we're going to go. Okay, I feel like this looks way better. I mean, listen, in a perfect world, I wish these were like lined up, but I need it to make sense. So I just have my leave-in conditioners and stuff that I use when I get out of the shower, have my styling stuff, my style creams, and these are all my oils and like things to lay down some of my flyaways in there. And I have leave-in conditioners and a thick conditioner there. So it's not bad, you know, it looks better. Let me show you what I got rid of. This, I have enough uh heat protectant so this is so old i believe um i have like i love this shine spray but i have so many it's for aaron to use so i'm gonna put that in her room and then this is a shine spray i have enough of those um platinum taffy i just haven't been reaching for and then this is almost empty so i'm gonna give the rest to aaron see if she wants to use it but it's just a good leave-in I just have enough, so this is what we got rid of and pulled out the drawer, which gave us some extra space. It's not a ton, but our next drawer, I just wanted to clean and organize. These are all my makeup removers. You guys know they're my favorites. We have cotton balls and, girl, I don't know. We just get everything in here. I just need to clean it up a little bit. I don't know how much I'm gonna be getting rid of. I might get rid of these black makeup removers because I find that they do melt a little bit of black ink from them, so. I don't want that to get in my clothes or anything. So yeah, I might get rid of the black ones because I've been avoiding them because one time I, I noticed. So put that in the get rid of pile and then let's just clean all this stuff up. Look at this giant scrunchie there. I just love it. I don't know why, it just makes me so happy. So I'm gonna keep this, and I like to keep stuff in here like my head wraps and all. So whenever I'm washing my face, like even my little scrunchies to put them on my wrist from Amazon, I like to keep it all in here so I go to the store and it just has everything in it. I'm gonna put my hair towels here. I love these. Get these off Amazon as well. These are like a silk bonnet. So if I have my hair done or extensions in or something crazy hairstyle that I need to preserve, I would sleep in this bonnet. However, I typically wake up with it off my head. And then this is my absolute favorite shower cap. I'm like, where is this even from? I don't know, it's probably from Amazon, but it just, it's the one. It works if I need a shower. You can tell I've got makeup on it, but if I need a shower, it grips onto my head so well. It's my favorite. My little hand scrunchies. I'm just putting all my stuff like that over here that I don't reach for like every single day. Actually, these I use a lot, but these are for Latisse. I'm not currently using it, but I do have it. So I'm gonna save these. I don't know, does poopery need to go in here? I don't think so. All right, guys, we got rid of some old cloths that I haven't been using and stuff like that. And this drawer makes me so happy. This is what I'm talking about. This one with my drawer so like I can see everything, my hair towels, tampons. I normally have more pads in here, but uh, apparently I'm almost out. <laughs> Need to get some more of those. Uh, razor stuff. Oh, this looks so good on my, on my makeup removers. I love these things. You guys know that. I use one every single night that I take my makeup off. So, and I'll just like pull from this in wash it and then it'll go back on this end i don't know why i'm like that but i it's the virgo in me anyways this really looks so good let's move on oh, to some of the hair stuff 
This should be, should this new Gisu honey, oh, just kidding, it's Wild Rose, the original one's honey. I kinda wanna keep it in this drawer because I feel like as I'm styling my hair, I'll remember to use it. It's hair perfume, yummy. But let's just straighten this bad boy out. This drawer actually has so much of my hair in it. I'm about to vacuum y'all. I'm about to vacuum it. We organize the hair ties of the bigger ones over here, the lighter ones. I don't know why I have lighter ones, but I do love these like felt cloth ones for when I do like half up dudes because they make up hair look thicker so like like the it's not like a skinny little band of hair it makes the hair like there's that much hair on top of your head because this is so thick so i like these i need to get some in black and then my regular ones bobby pins a long time ago at sheen i did buy these little elastics and i love them it came with so many and i'm just chipping away at it but i love these so much so keeping those I'm gonna get rid of this because I already have another one. I have this one. And then I also have this guy too that's more bristly. I also got sent these from Living Proof that have clear. The black ones obviously work better for my hair, but I'm gonna keep these to use. And then this is just some of my little styling clips in here. So. Now this is all my hair clips, so I'm gonna organize this a little bit because I have a bunch of combs in here as well. Here we have it, it looks so much better. No more hair, brush is clean, I love it. Finally diving into the worst drawer of all. <laughs> so my main main, this is where I reach in multiple times a day for skincare, you know. I gotta pull everything out of here and we gotta, we gotta re-finesse. We gotta get rid of stuff too, which I hate doing. I love doing, but I don't wanna do, but let's do it. As I take out, I'm gonna try to organize, like set up top, like serums over here. So that way whenever I'm trying to Finesse it back. I don't know. Moisturizer. Face wash. Okay, but look how nasty. <laughs> oh my God. I'm gonna have to do some vacuuming and cleaning out. This is all that came out of the drawer. Oh my God. I don't wanna go through all this stuff, y'all. It's too much, it's too much. But first, let's clean.
kind of thinking moisturizers on this side, serums over here, tools over here, and then we're just gonna have to go with the flow for the rest, cause I don't know. I don't really know. This one will not fit, and I'm devastated, so what it means I need to get rid of it, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna set her right there, okay? And then I had to cram these, unfortunately, and I need to clean that. I think I'm gonna do eye creams up front, and then serums here and here. tall serums and unfortunately they're kind of wonky because they have to lay down for the door to close. These are my shorter serums, eye creams, and lip balms. Actually we gotta put her in here too because I want to keep that all together. This is a little moisturizer sample but my moisturizers and then I put my prescription stuff and some sunscreens and neck cream in there. So here I want to put some of my smaller items and then in here my tools. guys this drawer has so much more space and looks so much better however i can't fit all of my face washes and stuff in it anymore so i'm like oh what am i gonna do i need to find somewhere else to put them but it does look better you know we get our eye creams our serums some of my prescriptions and toothpaste all the tools moisturizers and everything else it's just put away to a t it looks so good we have this little space right here i need to put something in there but we did a good job I just have to find somewhere to put all this. I did throw a few tools and stuff in there that I'm not using to get rid of, but guys, I have a hard time getting rid of this stuff. All right, this next drawer is literally lame. I'm just gonna fold these and put them back in. We did it. The drawer looks so much better. <laughs> My one easy drawer. Okay, what is next? <gasps> My backup skin. Dun, 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 dun. This is where I gotta get rid of stuff. This is the moment. I just took a lunch break from doing this and you might be like, where is your makeup at? It's gone. <laughs> I went ahead and took it off to be comfy, but I have to tell you guys about Dune. Dune 2 came out and I watched it. So while we clean this drawer out, I'm gonna tell you my thoughts on Dune 2. As a person who is not a specific Dune fan and I low-key have never seen Dune 1. So I went and saw Dune 2 last night and I kind of like was like, I don't want to see it. I don't want to see it because I hadn't really seen the first one. So I'm not into the Dune movies only because I haven't taken the time to watch it because it's one of those movies you definitely can't play on your phone. Like you've got to give it all the focus. So the only thing that I've seen of Dune 1 is my husband, Small Business. This is a cleansing balm and it's a really, really good one. This one's really popular at Desi Skin. So he, he rewatched it because the second one was coming out and he was like, by the way, these are face washes. But he was like, I need you to watch this because I'm gonna take you see it with me. I did not pay attention. I played on my phone the whole time and then I just got him to explain to me what happened in the movie. I do this to my husband a lot and he's still married to me, so. We went to see Dune 2 and I put up a fit because I'm not into Dune because I didn't watch it. I end up absolutely freaking lutely loving it. Keep in mind, Ty told me what it was about, so I understood the storyline going into it, so I wasn't that confused. This movie is 
a lot different how I said than the first one because he said this one is the first one is all about the setup so it's just a lot of communication a lot of talking and stuff like that and this one is everything they set it up for all of the action I'm telling you this movie has so much action but done in one of the best ways I've ever seen done for some reason I'm so in love with all the characters even the bad guy I like love their characters because they played them so well Zendaya is sickening she's extremely badass timothy chalamet i love him as well i think he's such a good actor it's unreal what he did in that movie oh he's so good guys like this is the best thing i've seen him do look at all these moisturizers this is sick so anyways this one is just jam-packed with action um yeah now i'm like a huge doom fan after watching it i'm not gonna say anything about it because i don't i know there are like crazy dune fans out there and they will wreck me if i spoiled two seconds of it for them so i am not gonna do that to myself and i'm just gonna stay quiet this is enough moisturizer to last me. Probably go through like two every three to four months, maybe. No, probably like every three months I go through two of these. There's, so yeah, this is like, this would last me like two years. I love the Tatcha Rice Powder. It's one of my favorite products. I need to use this more. And I'm putting all my face washes here as well to store them in here because they won't fit in the drawer up top. Back to Dune. If you're not a Dune fan, I highly recommend seeing the movie. It is kind of long. It's two, it's like two hours and 45 minutes. I think the runtime is. So you're looking at close to three hours. So I like to watch movies like that at home specifically because I feel like I'll be going crazy for real, like in there. Sometimes I just need to like get up blink stretch you know whenever you're in there for so long i always do this to see if the drawer will close with it standing up in case you're wondering what i'm doing i got these little trays at target in the dollar section this one was one dollar and the big one was like three or four dollars All right guys, this is the drawer. It looks incredible. Some moisturizing serums here. Overflow moisturizers, moisturizers, moisturizer. Moisturizing mask, skin balm, Evian. They're trying to make me love this and it's starting to work. Uh, my face washes, my face scrubs and washes. And then here is just some more serums. And let me show you what I got rid of. Actually, I'm gonna put these two shorties in here. I want it, <laughs> you guys. This stuff is so good. I've used it for years and years and years. So a lot of people get me this as gifts or Lancome sends me most of this as well. I have an overflow and it's kind of a problem. And I don't want to get rid of it because I love it, but I'm like gonna have to look at the expiration because I want to give it to someone I love. Not me packing this drawer out. Is that gonna close? Dang it. Ugh, you guys, this is so hard. Okay, I'll get rid of these two and I'll keep the big guy. Okay, this is what we're getting rid of. I really don't want to get rid of this. I want to use it. I like her brand. She has this Lumi Drops that I'm obsessed with and her lip balms. But I just have so much stuff I cannot keep. I love her reward. You guys know that. Love Miss Ula. I have so many vitamin C creams. But I'm not getting rid of this stuff because I don't like the brands. So yeah, I have to let go of some stuff. Makes me so sad because I love skincare. This drawer is like shampoo and conditioner and like body wash stuff, like shower stuff that I've got too much of in here. So we're gonna clean it out. You know the routine. This is empty and I just kept it because it's refillable. So if I repurchase, I didn't want to get rid of it, but this was a pretty good cleanser. I will always use shampoo and conditioner, so I do like to keep a lot of them on backup. I'm putting my body scrubs and moisturizer tubs back here. If you're wondering where my minimal LA ones are, they are in my shower. So I'll show you real quick what I'm using right now from Minimum. My camera just died, so now we're on my phone, but check it out. <laughs> 
check us out, okay? Tell her I got me these body washes, one for my birthday and one for Christmas, and I haven't used them because I have some. I'm almost finished using up, but I do love both these. So these are the Baccarat Rouge 540 perfume. This is the body wash of it. I gotta smell this and remember what it smells like. And then I love salt and stone as well, so. Okay, we are done with this drawer. I have my body moisturizers and scrubs and some soaps. And then I have hair stuff and just some feminine products here. Extra body washes, extra body lotions. Boom, and we have a little space. But I did get rid of a lot out of this drawer. I have more shampoos than conditioners, so I had to get rid of a couple of my shampoos. Double this. This keeps leaking everywhere, so I just gotta get it out of this drawer if I wanna use it. Too many washes i have this new gloss i want to try out from way so i just don't need two and that is what we got rid of oh my god our next drawer is more skincare oh it's so hard for me guys but we're gonna dive in this is my mask drawer i love a good face mask but i do feel like a couple of these could be expired because it's not something i'm using every single day oh and we have, see this serum needs to be moved and i need to check dates on this stuff i'm gonna have to get rid of some stuff Stop. Taking everything in my power right now not to go get a Dr. Pepper because I've been trying to cut down on my Dr. Pepper drinking, okay? Even more, just to try it. <laughs> and here we are, and I want one. This mask will always be one of my favorites. I have been using this forever whenever I have breakouts, so. Keeping it! Here is the finished drawer. It looks so much better. I did have to take a lot out, but these are my mask. More mask, more mask, a lip balm. This is my mask tools, as well as two Tatcha masks. We have the clay, and then this one is like an overnight mask, like a moisturizer. So we have those in there. Q-tips, Lancome mask. This is a body mask from Kate Sunwell, and this is one of my favorites. I just didn't know where to put it, like low key. I Ideally would like it right there. So actually I'm gonna leave it there even though it doesn't look as clean It's just better for me And then this is some Vaseline as well as some tea tree oil and some more mask right there So my mask drawer is so much better. Let me show you what I got rid of This is like empty so I'm actually gonna throw it in the trash. I don't know why I had that in there Next drawer is Ty's drawer. Look at this diva. Look at this diva. All his skincare and hair care. Okay, Ty. Let me just organize this.
right guys, this is the drawer now. We have his tools, hair care products, face washes, deodorants, as well as all of his skincare moisturizers and then serums and a couple scrubs. I know he uses these every night, so I put them on top, but it looks so much better. The next drawer is just random storage for Ty, like his backup products and all. So I'm just gonna straighten this drawer up. is cleaned out and then this is the actual backup drawer for him so I'm gonna put his backup products in this drawer Here's a look at this drawer. It's just a bunch of backup, like teeth stuff and mouthwashes. So I just organized that. And then our pills that we love, his backup soap, and that is pretty much it. And that was the last of it. This is what we got rid of. I have a small bag of trash from all the drawers, but not much. And these are extra containers and my cleaning supplies. Now I just wanna wipe down this counter really well to clean it so I can say it's all clean. And I'm probably gonna vacuum in here as well. There's always these little lashes everywhere haunting me. They're the, um, the ones that you can press and go without glue. So I just pluck them off and they end up everywhere. Love that for me. thought the video was over well it's not just kidding it kind of is but anyways don't forget to check out our new launches at minimala.co we have the new tumbler with simply modern and we have a new romance me dress which i've been talking about for a hot minute as well as new jewelry and accessories don't forget to shop our slouch socks which are almost sold out so yeah check us out at minimala.co also subscribe to my channel before you leave subscribe Okay, the video is really over now. Bye, guys.